played that tune so many times over the past few months live and direct and every time it just goes down a storm and when those little stabby bits come in they just catch everyone by surprise love that tune to death out on skinch records express 2 with ac dc you voted that your 10th best tune of the year 2000 and this came in at number nine for chris cowie on bellboy records therapy I think it's been nine years now that we've been doing the top 20 tunes of the previous year as compiled from the top 10s that you've been sending me and I was looking forward to doing the uh, 10th year next one but I won't be able to now because BFBS have been doing some audience research and the results of that lead them to believe that it's best to be a pop station 24 hours a day poppy stuff 
and get rid of all the John Peels, all the Steve Masons, all the Darren Carrington. So that's exactly what they're going to do. So this will be the last Top 20 programme. And my last programme on BFBS will be on Saturday, the 27th of January. Chris Cowie at number nine and Therapy, that's on Bellboy Records, number 46. Forces Weekend. The Forces Station. Forces Radio. Absolutely spondaciously kicking out like a big bad bull. Yours truly, Mr. Mason. Yeah, www.bfbs.com is the place to air your opinions. Don't email me because there's nothing I can do about it. www.bfbs.com is a website address of BFBS. At number eight, you voted me, which is rather nice. Steve Mason with Kokokoa on Experience 2000. I'm not 
Many thanks for voting that your eighth best tune of the year 2000. Myself, Steve Mason, with Kako Kawa on Experience 2000 Records. At number seven, just a top tune, some real drum and bass influence. It came out on Intensive Records. It rejoiced in the name Animated Projectile Funk, a wicked name from Vitkoff Rock. Tune in. Tune in.
seriously uh, pumping breakbeats in there. Some lovely grooves, really funky. Add on intensive records, animated projectile funk from Vitkoff Rocks. You voted that your seventh best tune of the year, 2000. And coming in at number six, the first one from Timo Maas. A big year for him, voted the top DJ in Germany in the German Dance Awards. And that is no surprise.
Yeah, some just some really good noises, some really good breakdowns. All works rather, rather nicely, doesn't it? Your sixth best tune of the year 2000 comes from Timo Maas on Perfecto Records. Ubik the dance is that, and this is at number five. Loads of people vote for this one. Muzak, Trisco, yeah, here we go.
is the top five tunes that you selected for the year 2000, and that is at number five on VA Recordings, the first release on that label, and what a release. Trisco and uh, Muzak, what is going to be number one, narrowing the field down a bit now. There's a few of those records that have just got to be somewhere up there, but in which order do they come? This is at number four for the two bald men in on the Experience 2000. This is Forward Thinking.
like that little drum roll in there. It's nice, isn't it? Out on Experience 2000 a few months ago, the two bald men with forward thinking. You voted that your fourth best tune of the year, 2000. And at number three comes something uh, really original, really hard, and with an incredible bass drum. Yeah, it's Alter Ego, Betty Ford.
Yeah, it just stands out so much on the dance floor when that bass drum sort of goes back on itself and then kind of eats itself. Really excellent sound. Alter Ego there on Clang Records. Uh, Betty Ford is the track. You voted that your third best tune of 2000. Steve Mason. You have been brought up in front of this court today, charged with playing music at excessive sound levels. What do you please? Guilty or not guilty? Innocent! <laughs> Take him down. You voted this your second best tune of the year. Rennie Pilgrim, Paranoia, goes down a storm on the dance floor.
Okay, let's take a run down the top 20 tunes as voted by you from sending in your top 10s to me over the past few weeks for the year 2000. At number 20, you voted Patrick Lindsay and Monica Cruz with You Like at 19, The Micronauts with Baby Wants to Bleep and Leo and Bushwhacker at number 18. At 17, Pascal Fails with the Paul Britchich remix of Overflow. At 16, Luke Slater's Body Freefall Electronic Inform. And at 15, Techno Disco, the Pascal Faos remix. Two Bald Men at 14 with Bring the Drummer In. Bushwhacker at 13 with The Sound. At 12, Kagami watching tonight too. And at 11, Justin Berkovy with Sustained Buxom Mad Chips. Express 2 were at number 10 with ACDC. At number 9, Chris Cowie with Therapy. And at number 8, Marcel Steve Mason with Kako Koa. At seven, Vidkov rocks with animated projectile funk. Timo Mars at 60 at six with Ubik the dance. Muzak and Trisco at five. The two bald men with forward thinking at four. Alter Ego at number three with Betty Ford. At number two, we've just heard it. Rennie Pilgrim and Paranoia. What's at number one? It's got to be... The record that blows the floor apart every time you play it. Azido da Bass, that Dooms Night track, remixed by Timo Mars. Yeah. 
Bass Dooms Night, the Timo Mars remix on Adel Records. And thanks very much to all of you that have sent in your top tens. Without them, I couldn't have compiled the top 20 tunes of the year 2000. In next week's program, we're back to the regular kind of things, some new tunes, some old tunes, and we are in the mix. Look forward to catching you then. Up until then, stay very, very cool. And from me, Steve Mason, take it easy. See you next week. Bye.